What's up everybody, it's your boy Chameleon right here for City Vibes. Today we're here with VIP Latin Productions for the one and only DJ Yanni, who is currently, as we speak, tearing it up on the ones and twos. The atmosphere is electric, the dance floor is jammed, and as you can see, everyone here is dressed to impress. Now tonight's performance is a one night only performance, as next week DJ Yanni will be in Holland and Belgium. Now your boy Chameleon, AKA DJ Chameleon, was lucky enough to open up for this up and coming superstar. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna head inside and we're gonna take a look at what's going on. So let's go, come on inside with me, let's go. DJ Yanni's show was an absolute blast, something the city of Calgary has rarely had a chance to indulge in. A master turntablist with showmanship and stage command, DJ Yanni is one of the premier DJs in New York City, and Calgary clubbers got to enjoy this amazing taste of New York City night. City Vibes had a chance to meet with the talented DJ Yanni, and we discovered some interesting things about this up and coming superstar. I'm, I'm, uh, thank you. I'm, I'm here and uh, I'm excited to be here. It's my first time in Calgary. Never been here. Uh, thank you. Um, I've been DJing since I'm 29 now. I've been DJing since I was 11 years old. And uh, this is something I've, I've had a passion for. I had a passion for music and uh, kind of moved my way up the ranks. I've been on you know, New York City radio. I'm on New York City radio, Philadelphia radio. I've traveled the world. So it's, it's been pretty cool. Yeah, well, when I first started music, I, I actually played the drums in high school. I, I, I played the drums, we, we played, I, I was in the band, I, I did the marching band, stuff like that. And uh, my mother and father, my mom is Colombian, my father is Puerto Rican. And my mother, she was a, a professional salsa dancer. And she was good with, you know, uh, with the salsa music and merengue, bachata, all that. And then my father, he grew up in like the, you know, Woodstock age, he was like a rock and roll head. He listened to like Pink Floyd and Black Sabbath and, and Led Zeppelin and things like that. So me growing up, I had, you know, me, I was a hip hop head at the time. And, you know, growing up with all these types of music, it kind of gave me the, the opportunity to be very diverse. And, and, and you know, my, my musical knowledge today is, is pretty good because of it. For me, um, like I said, I've done, you know, I'm, I'm on radio, I've, I've done television, Rash of the Mix, um, and, and now um, I'm, I'm really focusing on my production. I, I'm known uh, I'm in, in, um, in the DJ world as a, as a pretty good remixer and producer, so my next venture, um, my next goal, I mean, now, to the, uh, now I'm to the point where I've actually accomplished all the goals that I've ever wanted as a kid. Now I'm making new goals. And my next one for my next personal goal is to be or to make, a, you know, some some good hit music, you know, make a hit record or, or you know, produce from some good artists. So that's that's my next thing in line and, and continue to tour the world. And Johnny, thank you. Thank you for the interview. Thank you for the time. Thank you for having me. And I love Canada. I love Calgary. What's up, everybody? We're here with my boy, Tony Martin. What's up? Hey, Tony Montana. Now, Tony, I gotta ask you, this event is an absolute smash and success. So, so tell me, what's next on the radar for VIP Latin Productions? What are you guys gonna do to follow up with this? Well, first of all, we're so happy to have DJ Yanni from New York. I think it was a successful night. Oh, yeah. What do you think? Absolutely, absolutely, without a doubt. So, I don't wanna tell some secrets, but the DJ from Pitbull's next. His boss, DJ's next. Hey, listen, if you know anything about anything about music, let me tell you something. DJ's Pitbull, Pitbull DJ, sorry, my bad, is going to be a huge show. 